Bob Nato is the owner of the Logic Columbia Point. And when all of this had happened, we had to lay off the majority of the employees from um, the restaurant, the bar, and of course, with low occupancy, it was just kind of a skeleton crew. So Bob had applied and got the um, small business assistance loan. And with that, um, all of that went towards payroll. And so since those departments are still closed in the hotel, we have 50 plus employees and not a lot of work to keep them occupied uh, for full-time schedules. So after he applied for that, him and Wendy, our general manager, um, had got together and said, you know, what's the best use of this? What can we do um, to actually make an impact? And starting two weeks ago, we got everybody in here, got all of the employees um, kind of trained up, practicing the health and safety, obviously, everything to ensure that everybody's working safely. Yeah, it's been really exciting to get everybody moving and back to work. We all work in different departments at the lodge, so although we're all co-workers, we haven't had as much opportunity to work with one another closely. So even though we're all socially distanced, this project has allowed all of us to get a lot closer um, to one another as co-workers and work together. So Grace Kitchen is a job training, mentoring program for women living in poverty here locally in the Tri-Cities. My heart is just like exploding with gratitude from so many businesses. We have Service Master upstairs, shampoo in the carpets. We have Basin Disposal that has stepped in and um, taking care of all of our trash needs. Um, you know, the Lodge bringing all of their employees. We have so many community members involved in Grace Kitchen that just love the mission of Grace Kitchen and want to see these women employed and empowered and be able to have um, a life change.